The White Van by Patrick Hoffman is a gripping and intense thriller novel that explores the darker side of human nature through the eyes of its central characters. Set in San Francisco, the story follows Emily Rosario, a young woman who is kidnapped by two men in a white van and held for ransom. As the police investigation unfolds, the lines between good and evil become blurred, and the story becomes a complex web of deceit, violence, and corruption. The novel is written in a fast-paced and cinematic style that keeps the reader on edge throughout. Hoffman's prose is spare and efficient, with a focus on action and dialogue that keeps the story moving at a brisk pace. The novel is structured in short chapters that alternate between different characters' perspectives, allowing the reader to see the events from multiple angles and adding to the sense of tension and suspense. The characters in the white van are complex and multidimensional, with their motivations and actions often shrouded in mystery. Emily, the victim, is a sympathetic character who is forced to confront her own limitations and fears as she fights for survival. Meanwhile, the two kidnappers, Wyatt and Riddell, are portrayed as ruthless and violent men who will stop at nothing to get what they want. However, as the story progresses, the reader learns that their motivations are not as clear-cut as they first appear, and they too are struggling with their own demons. The police officers investigating the case, Inspector Trotter and Detective Wong, are also complex characters with their own strengths and weaknesses. Trotter is a seasoned veteran who is determined to solve the case at any cost, while Wong is a young officer who is still finding her feet in the department. Their interactions with each other and with the other characters in the novel provide insight into the workings of law enforcement and the challenges they face in a city plagued by crime. One of the key themes of the white van is the corrupting influence of power and money. The kidnappers' motives are driven by a desire for wealth and status, and they are willing to resort to violence and intimidation to achieve their goals. Meanwhile, the police officers are forced to navigate a complex web of political and bureaucratic pressures that often interfere with their ability to do their jobs. Through their actions and interactions, the novel portrays a city where the lines between right and wrong are blurred, and the pursuit of power and wealth often comes at a terrible cost. The novel also explores the themes of fear and vulnerability. Emily's ordeal at the hands of her kidnappers is a harrowing portrayal of the terror that can result from being at the mercy of others. The other characters in the novel are also grappling with their own fears and insecurities, whether it is Trotter's fear of failure or Wyatt's fear of being caught. Through their struggles, the novel suggests that fear can be both a source of strength and a source of weakness, depending on how it is channeled. In conclusion, The White Van is a gripping and intense thriller novel that explores the darker side of human nature. Through its complex characters, fast-paced plot, and themes of power, corruption, fear, and vulnerability, the novel provides a thought-provoking and engaging read that will keep readers on the edge of their seats until the very end. Hoffman's writing is spare and efficient, with a focus on action and dialogue that keeps the story moving at a brisk pace. Overall, The White Van is a must-read for fans of crime and thriller fiction, and a powerful exploration of the human condition.